Okay, thank you Toastmaster of the day, Toastmaster Iza. Hello and good morning everyone. I'm very happy and excited to handle the table topic session today. Because I want to hear and know more about uh, our Miracle Toastmaster uh, members. Uh, so maybe we can get something or learn from their sharing. Uh, so for um let uh let me explain first how this session will go. I have prepared about five topic, so the speaker can randomly choose uh the topic by choose by choosing uh the flower that you like, and it will show the topic that you need to tell. The theme of table topic today is about flashback. So, uh, the speaker can talk anything about the moment related to yours. Uh, and let's see if you don't have any idea, you can share about other people's experience or story that can relate it, uh, with the topic. Okay, the time allocated for each speaker is one to two minutes. Uh, is it clear? Yes, Mujahida, very clear. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, you can choose uh, one of the flowers that you like. Mm -hmm. Okay. So in that, you will get the topic. <laughs> All right, so I will choose hibiscus. Okay. Yeah, All right. Do I need to start now? Uh, ah yeah, you, you oh, may start Mujahada, now. Mujahada, you need yeah. to read the uh read the topic and then the the okay. speaker name and the speaker name and then uh, the topic two times. Okay. Okay, the top the topic is what is your first job experience like? Sela. So, okay. Sela. Sela, hmm. you may start. One time. Sela, what was your first job experience? Oh, Sela, what was your first job experience like? All right, so. Ah, uh, Sela, you unshare the screen first, and then we can share the face. screen. Unshare, then. All right, then you can start. Okay, so what was my job? My first job, right? So I started my first job. Uh, when I was done with my STPM. So during that time, I think I was like 20 years old. And then my first job was at a newspaper company that called Daily Express Sabah. And during that, during that time, I was a typist and I was responsible to edit the layout of the newspaper after the editor like done with the story with the journalist. And then I ha I have to put the story in the layout, you know, the layout of the newspaper, like in a physical newspaper, not like online newspaper. Then, uh, so basically I work in a Chinese company. Then it was really hard for me because uh, Chinese people like, sorry, Yoko, but for me, Chinese people like to work in a fast paced kind of situation. So I have to like do a lot of things during my first week. So it was kind of like stressing me out, but I love learning, right? So I just do it. And then uh, my boss, my ex-boss was like, good job, Sela, because I kind of like the kind of fasting learning. So yeah, it was a good challenge for me. But I while I was there, I was exposed to many different types of people. I met a lot of uh, professional, like expert of people because they know how to do their job. And then it was my first experience. Then since I had to work with computer and editing, I quickly learned all of the shortcut keys and it really helps me until now because now my job is like HR and admin, but I also work as a digital team. And then I think that is why I love computer editing, you know, video editing, picture editing, like AI, InDesign, you know, I love all of that. And because since I was working in the newspaper company, I started to have passion.
to have passion and I really like that kind of learning you know I love computer I love technology I love editing so uh, yeah that was my first job and I really like it until now thank you back to you uh, Mujada Okay, thank you Toastmaster Sela for sharing the beautiful experience of yours. Okay, next, the second speaker. Uh, I will choose uh, Nora. Nora, hello. Hello, yes. Uh, yes. Okay. <clears throat> uh, what kind of flower that you want to choose? Rose. Rose, okay. Okay, the question is, what is your dream destination? Those master Nora, you can start your speech. What is your dream destination? I believe that everyone has a dream. Dream is something which is important for me because with dream, I believe that I can, with the dream, with the dream, I believe that I can go far and I can plan what I want to achieve. And people say dream, just dream because dream, we do not have to pay for what we want, what we dream of. My dream is I would like to have financial freedom. For me, financial is something which is important in everyone's life. And to be financial freedom, the most important thing that I believe is to plan our financial and to have a self disciplines for me wealth is a habit so what i do now in order for me to have financial planning is i make myself uh, disciplined with money especially in terms of i pay myself first. So for me, this is very, very important before I achieve my financial freedom. So every time I receive money, let's say that I receive money 500, so I make sure that I pay myself first for 10% so that this money will be a seed money. Next, I, I believe that to, to fulfill my dream in order to become a financial freedom is I have to be very disciplined in top money, like I said just now. I have to empower myself first. And I have a mentor. Because from the mentor, I can learn a lot and I can also plan well how to achieve my goal. In conclusion, I hope that everyone can have a dream so that 
you can achieve what you want in life, no matter what, because dream can lead you to self-motivation. With that, thank you. Okay, thank you, Toastmaster Nora. Okay, um, uh, for sharing the great uh, experience in your dreams. Okay, next, can we go to our guest, Daniel? All right, I'll take. Dahlia, since it's also a D. Okay. okay. So the question is, are you a night person or a morning person? Uh, Toastmaster... Eh, sorry. Uh, uh, Toastmaster Daniel. Boleh je. Okay. <laughs> sorry. All right. Okay. Morning, everyone. And I would like to start off by just saying that I am usually a night person because it is... Something I learned back when I was in university, I think, when I was studying and then I realized and I found out that it seemed more productive and more efficient. More things can be remembered. I can write more. I can write more creatively, for example. And my theory is that because at night, the sun is set, right? There's no sun in the sky and so things are generally a bit more quiet and things are also not as heated as they are in the daytime. And I found that my brain liked those, that combination of elements where it's quiet, it's calm, and it's a bit cooler than it is in the daytime. And so I realized that because of that, I came to label myself as a night kind of person. But now, unfortunately, after leaving university and entering the working life, it seems that society generally needs people to become morning people instead because you cannot go into the office at nine in the morning and then say, hang on, boss, I'm not awake yet. I need to really get some time to set my brain and become more effective. You, know, you can't do that in the workplace. You can't do that at all. It's not acceptable. You have to show up at 8.30 and you've got to be already switched on in the brain and start performing, all right? So it is my absolute blessing at this point in my life that I come in to working life. And I also come in to know about Miracles Toastmasters Club because again, Miracles, you have your, your meetings in, in, in early morning. And that will really help me, I believe, to transition from a night person to a morning person because in life, resilience is one of the words used earlier. Resilience is always very important. So thank you very much. And back to you, Table Topics Master. So now may I invite the table topic evaluator to Master Nashita. Over to you. Thank you, Toastmasters of the day. Okay, so firstly, I am going to evaluate Marcella's speech with the title, What was your first job experience is like? So Marcella, I really love your, your speech. I really love your speech because you give us such a deep and detailed insight of what is it like uh, for, to be in the job that you got. The story is very detailed, which I like, and it's very structured. You explain everything about what you do and how was the clique. And how was the clique. But uh, uh, for room of improvement, I would suggest um to add why did you leave your first job or um do you have a time where you feel like quitting because this is your first time working so it must have a time that you feel like oh i can i cannot do this anymore so maybe it's more interesting if you could could add something uh, like that so it can be a little more climax and interesting okay so that is for marcella uh next is for Kat Nora. What is your dream destination? What I like the most from Kat Nora's speech is how she pauses uh, regularly to properly construct her, her sentence. And it also starts with her own definition of dream. And at the same time, 
it allows me to have proper time to reflect about what uh, she was saying and how can I reflect it to my own dream. But for room of improvement, I could say that she could add what is she going to do with the financial or with the money that she obtained after she already obtained her financial freedom. And lastly, for Daniel, are you a night person or a morning person? What I like the most uh, regarding your speech is uh, I love how you speak detail about how you both as a night person and as a morning person. Uh, I love how you give us a very detailed example and it makes us more... Um, can have the same experience as you. We can go through together the story with you. But for room of improvement, since you talk about your transition from your from a night person university to a morning person uh, when you are working, I would like to know how you adapt to the situation. And you could also add what you are able to do when you are a morning person now that you cannot do when you are a night person in a university. And that probably will add much more uh, interesting story. And we might uh, want to hear more about your. Uh, overall, I love the table topic session. The topic is uh, so, it's good. It's good and well done everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Table Topic Evaluator Toastmaster Nashita for the detailed evaluation. 